coming to you mon petit pois with a sprinkle of glitter on top omg we've gone old school next thing you know i'll be saying aloha sprinklerinos to you uh hello hello i've got an exciting vlog for you this week i'm about to go to london with darcy and we're having a lovely lovely weekend before I go any further, I know that some of you will be able to hear that I have a bit of a cold. For anybody that needs to be reassured, just so you know, I've done two COVID tests on separate days. Uh, they both came back negative. I don't feel COVID y. Um, I have had COVID uh, before earlier this year, which was not a lot of fun. This doesn't feel anything like that. Uh, both the tests came back negative, uh, and I've also had my first jab a couple of weeks ago now. So uh, I really don't have COVID, but I do have a bit of a cold. It's on its way out now. I've medicated myself to the hilt, uh, so I sound worse than I feel. Um, but I thought I would just share that in case anybody thought, oh my goodness, you don't sound well. So we're going to London, and we are staying in a hotel tonight. Um, Darcy and I are going to go on our own to begin with, and we're going to have a little moot around Covent Garden, uh, see where the day takes us, and then see evening my friend and her daughter are joining us and tomorrow and we're all staying in the same hotel not the same room obviously uh, then tomorrow um, Darcy and her friend are going to be dancing at the Royal Academy of Dance uh, for a program they're doing there so it's uh, a bit of a dancey weekend um, and my friend and I thought why don't we make a bit of a thing of it we booked this way back in I think January time when it was like very bleak uh, we wanted something to look forward to and it's finally here so I'm just packing uh, our case I'm just taking one case between Darcy and I because I'm going to have to carry this around tomorrow. Um, I've got like her little leotard in there, a little dress for her tonight. All my stuff is on this side. Um, and, and now I'm just waiting for Darcy to get here and we'll head off and take you along for the journey. So we're here at the station and we're going to go and get our train. Are you excited? Yes. What are you most excited about? Dancing. Dancing. Here we are. Let's go. busy just then wasn't it? Yeah. We found a quiet spot. <laughs> so for the most part the it's been like quite social distance but just getting off the train then wasn't very socially distanced was it? But everybody was like yeah much I don't normally make her wear a mask because the rules in our country are under 11s don't need to but it was just too crowded. It was too crowded I was like no <laughs> whack a mask on her that was too like you couldn't you couldn't not be breathing other people's air then it was so close. Uh, but we're gonna head off now to uh, our hotel, see if we can drop the case off. I'm not sure if we'll be able to, what with COVID and stuff, but we'll see if we can. Uh, and then we're gonna have a little around Covent Garden, aren't we? Get some lunch. So our taxi can't get to where our hotel is because it's like blocked off or something, but see that building there? Can you remember that building? Uh, yeah. Sort of. That's the old Google where I used to go all the time. I used to take you a lot, didn't I? Yeah. Mummy's choosing some chocolate for tonight. Here's the little midnight feast. Wait for it, I'm going to straighten my arm now. Just pick 
One more, whatever you like. We're going to have some try those at the hotel later. Yeah, they look so nice, don't they? Smell. Smells good. We have had a lovely little look around Covent Garden, haven't we? And got some cookies. Got some cookies. And now we're going to go back to our hotel because we can check in. We're going to freshen up, have a little taste test. Yeah. Have a little taste test and we'll give you a tour of the room as well. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, we've had a moment to take our shoes off. Darcy's lined them up so neatly just there. And we'll give you a, a proper tour. Do you want to help me or shall I do it? Okay, right, so here's the door where we just came in from and some little steps and Darcy's so carefully put our shoes just there. So coming round from the door we have the bathroom just here, so sink, lovely lit mirror. I really love it when hotels have mirrors with the lights in like that because you can do your makeup so nicely. Not that it matters these days now that we're all wearing masks and smudging our makeup everywhere but I like it nonetheless shaving mirror so that I can shave my beard off uh, towels loo and then shower just here like a walk-in kind of wet room style shower just there with Ren um, toiletries and a little shelf which is always handy to put your bits and pieces on so and we, then oh so we basically have a very normal bathroom oh just very normal just nothing very normal. to see here nothing to see except from this crazy bath what you climb in it and demonstrate the size. <laughs> okay, so this is basically half. Oh look, they've got a little caddy for toiletries just there. Please don't turn the bath on. No, I'm not going to turn the bath on. <laughs> there, that would do you very nicely, wouldn't it? And you could have a little shelf here for your cookies. Your milk and your cookies and your magazine. I just, I just, look, oh my goodness! You could really have a good soak, couldn't you? So then coming around from the bath, there's the front door and we've got a little like dressing um, area which is handy with a safe, some extra pillows, uh, tea and coffee. Oh look, I haven't seen them like this in hotels before but I imagine that's new Covid procedures, everything's all individually done, even the cups and everything. Uh, and then, oh look, this is a mini bar sweetie. A mini bar? A mini bar, so in nice hotels you get mini bars, but can you hold this while mummy does the key? Yes, of course I can. Look. Oh. Is it a fridge? Yeah, so sometimes hotels will fill that with all sorts of like treats, like chocolates and alcoholic drinks and things, but that one's not full. Alcoholic drinks for mummy. Yes. And then down here we've got fluffy slippers and an iron. Yes, fluffy slippers. And then what's in here? A little sewing kit. Um, shoe mittens. What is a shoe mitten? And then laundry bags. I'm not sure. What's a shoe mitten? I'm not sure what a shoe mitten is. And then so we come round here. Our little table area with our goodies. We're going to try those cookies in a second. Um, windows. Not much of a view. But it's London, so... That's okay, it's a little bit uh, Mary Poppins chim chimney. I'm expecting the chimney sweeps to go and do a jig there. And then this is our bed for the night. And you're having this side, are you? Yes, the cosy side. The cosy side. And then when we spin round, giant TV, huge mirror, and that's the view. What do you rate it out of 10? Actually, uh, I rate it 99. 99 out of 10. Good rating. Yeah. Good rating. And these are Ben's cookies, so I'm going to open them up. Who's Ben? Do you know him? Uh, no. <laughs> Is that good? It's like Nutella in there. Nutella. Oh my goodness. Have a try. Okay. My mum's getting her makeup on for dinner. That's some serious skill work there. Thanks, babes. So we're all dressed up and ready for dinner. Darcy, should we do our outfits? So my dress is from Next, it's a little floral sort of floaty tea dress number and then your dress is also from Next actually but I bought this a while ago, I've been waiting for it to fit so I'll stand back a little bit sweetie, so I'm not sure, do a little like shh, 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 like that, oh yeah, it's silky soft and then this jacket it's also think, from is Next. also from Next. And then this is a little necklace that I bought her for her birthday and then the bags are secret. 
and we can't tell you too much about our matching bags at the moment. But, but, uh, no, no, oh, okay, yep. Yeah. I got lipstick. Also, does got lipstick. I've got some lipstick on. I'm just putting the same trainers on as earlier. Um, and we're gonna go and meet our friends and we're gonna head to Byron Burger. <laughs> As you can see, we're back in the room and I didn't film anything of dinner apart from one clip of Darcy having a giggle with her friend. Uh, we were there with my friend and her daughter so I didn't really feel like I could just whip the camera out. Uh, but I did take a ton of pictures. Where have you gone? Oh, you're hiding. I took loads of pictures. We had a little photo shoot, didn't we, Doodles? Yeah. Um, so they'll be on Instagram. I just want to show you Darcy's pyjamas because they're melting me. Oh, look at this modelling. So nice. So lovely. These are like silky they're from last year but they were too big last year so they fit now well they're still too um, big <clears throat> they're still a bit too big aren't they you're going to grow into them but I'll have them when I'm 13 <clears throat> so that'll be good that will be good and then I've just got my standard gym jams on it's always the way isn't it when you have kids they're like decked out to the nines and you've got your pyjamas on they've got like holes in them but you're comfy uh, right so our friends are going to come and join us now uh, for a bit of chit chat time and then I'm going to finish editing um, my video oh they're here oh okay uh, and I'll see you tomorrow well, it's like a good morning to you say good morning to everybody good it. morning I slept very well these beds were so comfortable the pillows are really nice as well I often think a pillow can make or break a bed but it was a good pillow um, I've just uploaded last week's video so do go and watch that if you haven't watched it yet and we are going to head out for breakfast aren't we? Yeah we're going to go to Starbucks. We're going to go to Starbucks. Um, our friends are also staying in the same hotel as us and they're going to come as well so I didn't film much last night because we were with them obviously I was being social and all that kind of jazz so I don't know how much footage I'm going to get today. I'm actually feeling a little bit like nervous about it. I've been doing this for 11 years but I still feel nervous whipping up my camera sometimes. You've been sometimes. doing it for 11 years before I was born? Yeah. For one year before I was born? Was that when you were pregnant? Um, before I was pregnant even. I told the internet I was pregnant. Sit up a bit. Ah. You could actually go and watch that video of me saying I'm pregnant and it's you that I was pregnant with before I even knew that you knew you were a girl, before I knew that you were doodles. Wait, did you Hey, Sit up a bit, show me Did you think it was going to be a yeah? I like it. Did good. you think it was going to be a boy or a girl? I thought you were going to be a boy. Why? I don't know. I just had a feeling that you were going to be a boy. Uh, and then when we went for the scan, so Daddy and I went for the scan at 20 weeks when I was 20 weeks pregnant, and they said you were a girl, and I cried, and then I think Daddy even was a bit emotional about it. And then the sonographer cried as well. The sonographer? Who's the sonographer? The, the lady doing the scan. Because oh. we were all just so happy. It was one of the most happy moments of my whole life, finding out that you were you. And also about Pearl. And also about Pearl as well. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Right. What were you doing with my hair? You were just fiddling with it anyway. I was just dawdling it because when you're a mummy, you just love your children just so much. You just want to cuddle them and stroke their hair and play with them all the time. Fuss them like little cats. Pearl can be your doll instead. <laughs> Look at this. Pearl can uh, be your doll instead. She's smaller. Maybe I could, f uh, not fast forward, what's the opposite? Rewind back to when I used to make vlogs with you as a tiny baby and be like, Baby glitter update. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, that's better than actually trying to do it in the mirror, it's better lighting. Uh, so this dress is from Nex and it was gifted to me by Christian, my stylist, from a shoot I did. So ad gifted from Christian and also from Nex, which is where it's from, has little puff sleeves with a frill, which I just think are so nice and really flattering. It's got a square neck and then if I stand up, it's sort of elasticated here, so no belt needed. And then it goes down to Hang on, I haven't got a tripod with me on this trip. It goes right down to sort of ankle length. Is that showing? And it has a little slit um, here. Now I have some little shorts on underneath. <laughs> Are you okay, doodles? <laughs> come on, yeah, come through, come through. Um, I just, I really like this. Such a lot, Darcy. Do you like this little dress? Mhm. Mm yeah? yeah. Did I you just have some cookie? <laughs> That's fine. Um, and then the necklace is from Abbott's Lion. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Um, right, before she demolishes all of that cookie, uh, I need to get packed. 
made such a mess and um, go and meet our friends. So we've just found this little nook that I've not been down before. How lovely is this? So cute. Oh, it opens up into some sort of majestical Mayflower haven and I love it. Starbucks is like Darcy's favourite place, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Oh, I've got an iced tea coming. This is the hand of a woman who's done this a lot of times. You're a pro, Natasha. nutritious lunch for me here. <laughs> My favourite food is yellow. Alrighty, we are home now. We had such a nice afternoon. Uh, we finished up at Gail's and had some little pastries. It was so yummy. Uh, and then picked up Darcy and Phoebe from um, the Royal Academy of Dance and then came back home. Everyone came into ours. Uh, Natasha has three beautiful little girls and they were all playing and Natasha's husband gets on really well with Liam. So they had a couple of drinks together. Um, and we tried to film a few shots of them like showing us the ballet bit so I will include those okay. here in a second but what I will say was it was a bit difficult to film it because there was kids everywhere there was stuff everywhere the garden's a mess uh, but I'll put a few clips of those here and a little clip of Darcy doing a little bit in the lounge as well heart didn't just melt my heart melted um that music that i put over it is not the actual music that was meant to go with it it's just some like youtube copyright free stuff uh but i think that's the end of the vlog do you think doodles yeah have you had a good weekend yes yes yeah, so i'm so glad to be back with my little um, pearly yeah, whirly did you have a good weekend pearly yeah yeah what have you been up to exciting you do something exciting what have you done that's been exciting? Playing. Playing. This will go on for a long time. I will leave it here. Lots of love. I will see you next week for another sensational video. Leave a friendly comment and I will see you soon. Lots of love. Bye.